Hey guys, Jared Beckwith here, and I'm proud to announce I'm quitting my job at the hospital as an EEG technologist. And what am I doing? Is this just an April Fool's joke? No, I'm actually not working at the hospital anymore. I'm devoting 100% of my time and energy to the performance testing of my EEG software ION. And this is my one chance to achieve everything I've ever dreamed of and that is a fact. This is what I've been dreaming of, guys. So I have to performance test my software against a company named Persist. And they are the old previous generation of seizure detection software and artifact reduction. They're, they're the old version. I initially in 2020 wanted to work there, but they decided I didn't have the right credentials. They were looking for a PhD. They weren't looking for an EEG technologist. I didn't, I didn't have the chops, guys, but everything comes full circle. And now three years later, I'm going to be performance testing what me, my brother, and my dad built against this big multi-million dollar company that nobody can beat in seizure detection. Natus billion dollar company tried to compete with them. They didn't stand a chance. Neon Coden, another big EEG company, they tried to make their own seizure detection to compete with Persist. Not a chance. They got annihilated. Persist has been on top for the last 30 years. So I got to pay my respects to the past, the past generation of seizure detectors. But now, my friends, there is a new generation of seizure detection and artifact reduction technology and i am bringing that to you guys they didn't believe an eeg technologist could do something like this they did they were disrespecting someone with actual clinical experience and they were going for someone who just has a phd well guys uh, i hope they hired a good phd I'll, I'll tell you that much we don't have any phds on our team we don't have any mds on our team we don't have millions of dollars, so it'll actually be quite embarrassing for them if they lose to us. And us, Ion, our company, we have nothing to lose, guys. It's just me and my family. And we will see if we are, in fact, the world's greatest EEG software. Now, a good way to look at this is like boxing. It's one-on-one, -on -one, guys, and the numbers don't lie. So I've been watching lots of boxing history videos. And when Mike Tyson went up against the heavyweight champion of the world, to, when he was 20 years old, he was fighting to become the youngest heavyweight champion ever. And he said in his pre-fight interview, the interviewers asked him, so what do you think about the champ, Mike? What do you think about him? He said, well, on paper, yeah, he's probably the best person that I could be compared against. But if the champ gets knocked out in one or two rounds, then what can we say? And just left it at that. That was crazy. And guess what happened, guys? Mike Tyson knocked out Trevor Burbick, the heavyweight champion, out in the second round. So it only took him two rounds. And he was the new world champion of boxing at 20 years old. The youngest to ever do it. Now, I'm trying to do the same thing only here with our EEG software. Now I say it'll take us one try. This is gonna be literally our first try. So if we do it on that, they're really in trouble. And if we do it on our second try, that, that's as many tries as it's gonna take, man. That's as many tries as it's gonna take. One or two rounds, boom, dispose with them in short order. And then we go on to testing and building our own seizure detector because if you have the world's cleanest EEG, which we are testing to see if we do, we you will have the ability to detect seizures better than anything else on the planet. You'll at least have the opportunity because the cleaner the record is, the easier it is to detect seizures, not only for humans, but for robots as well, AI. So this is going to be a world champion boxing match in the field of EEG. Can an EEG tech who was underestimated by the same company he wanted to work for, can he pull it off with just his will, desire, and the organized planning beforehand? 
can he pull off a upset against the world champion of seizure detection? We will have to see, guys. I'd say the experiment will take about 30 days to run efficiently, and we will get actual numbers. Then I will know exactly how good our, our artifact reduction software is, and I'll know if our thing is too aggressive or if it's not aggressive enough, and then we can make changes. And if we don't win on the first try, it's only gonna take two tries, man. We are the brightest minds in the field of EEG software. And it doesn't matter how many doctors they have on their team. It doesn't matter how many PhDs they hired. Let's just say they should have hired me, man. Three years ago, they should have hired me. And I'm so good now that they can't ignore me. They can run, but they can't hide. We're coming for them. And if we don't knock them out on the first try, it's going to take two tries maximum, baby. That's what we're here to do. We're here to win, show what an EEG technologist can do, show that there's no more disrespect in us. We are intelligent individuals, and we are a integral part of a patient's care. And don't underestimate us. We can do just as good as doctors and PhDs, guys. And that's what I'm here to approve if you guys support me, hit the like button. I appreciate your love and support. Leave a comment down below. Do you think we could do it? Do you think we can pull it off with all these disadvantages, lack of experience? I say it takes two tries maximum, guys. I really want to get them on the first try, though. And the crazy part is every single year they got to compete with us now. And we kind of keep getting better and better and better and better. So it's a foregone conclusion in my eyes, guys. Ion is the world's greatest EEG software, and now we just need the numbers to prove it. Give us a month with diligent and hard work. Diligence and hard work, we will prove within the next month we are the best artifact reduction software. Then we'll build the best seizure detector, and then we'll test it head to head on seizure detection. And then after that, we'll be the undisputed heavyweight champion of EEG software and my dreams will all come true. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.